Here's your Storm Track 7 forecast. Good morning and happy Thursday. I'm Storm Track 7 meteorologist Brandon Libby. We're seeing some scattered showers moving across our area this morning. Plan on a bit of a wet commute. Otherwise, some isolated showers and storms will be possible this evening into tonight. That's the kind of activity we'll have heading into the weekend for tomorrow and for Saturday. But if we do develop any storms on Saturday, there's a chance that some of them could be strong to severe. Uh, that won't be the case for today, though. Here's the wall of rain that we've been seeing moving slowly from west to east. It's been in our western counties already, and uh, we'll see it uh, producing maybe some pockets of heavier showers at times or even a couple of storms not out of the question. By noon, it's into our eastern counties and it's starting to fizzle out. After that, mostly cloudy skies should be expected. We'll have a brief break from the rainfall early to mid afternoon and then maybe some isolated showers and storms pushing back in for this evening and into tonight. You see this is midnight here. Maybe some pockets of heavier showers and storms will be possible south of I 80 by midnight and uh, we'll see our skies becoming partly cloudy for the day tomorrow. We'll still have that haze in the atmosphere as well. Uh, and while most of the day will be dry, we can't rule out an isolated shower or storm popping up mainly in the afternoon hours of Friday. There's some right there and then you'll see some popping up in southwestern Wisconsin for the evening hours. So that's the kind of activity we'll be dealing with throughout the weekend. For today, rainfall totals shouldn't amount to very much, generally about a tenth of an inch to a quarter of an inch. If we get some storms, could see up to half an inch of rainfall, considering the isolated activity for tonight. Still not going to bust us out of that drought, but something is better than nothing. Winds are a little more breezy today coming in from the south, 5 to 15 miles per hour. We'll notice those winds a bit stronger by the weekend, and those south winds will bring in more humidity and warmer temperatures. Dew points keep climbing from the mid-60s today and tomorrow to the upper 60s on Saturday. Could be into the low 70s at times heading into next week. For today, though, temperatures should be a bit cooler because of the cloud cover and the rain. We're going to look at our highs in the mid-70s north to about the low 80s in Waterloo and Tama. Otherwise, for tonight, isolated activity possible. We'll see our lows down to the mid-60s with partly cloudy skies. Here's your city by city forecast mid to upper 80s for Friday and Saturday. Uh, we'll see a chance for uh, that isolated activity for uh, both Friday and Saturday, but again, not going to be a washout all day long. The better chance for rain looks to come in here on Sunday and that will come with more cloud cover as well. After that low to mid 90s to kick off next week, we do have a few sporadic rain chances in there specifically for Tuesday, Thursday and Friday.